Hi guys, welcome to another Game Boys Ross video. As you can see, this is another episode of Cop episode 97. So episode 97 is finally here. So awesome. Hope you guys enjoy this one as all the rest. It's quite a long one. Hopefully you all will like, you know, enjoy it. Because I've been really enjoying getting these videos out as quick as I have been recently. It's been really awesome. And uh, all the new subscribers that I've been getting is just amazing. And all the new nice comments is just fantastic as always. So a massive thank you to everyone who has been coming to my channel and uh, just yeah, giving it a good old likes. It really means a lot. So yeah, this one I've got quite a few mixed up car boots in this one. So I'm hoping you guys will like it. And uh, yeah, you might be wondering why the hell am I out in the open in the really windy day it is. Um, I thought I'd do something a little bit different. Instead of just being in my game room or my bedroom, whatever you want to call it. Let's go out and enjoy the world. Yeah, but, uh, let's just go out and enjoy it. And this wind is insane. Right. Just enjoy the countryside, mate. This is awesome. I just didn't know what, oh, I had a plan to do it. I wanted to do something a bit different. And I actually wanted to find a tree that I could hang upside down on and do a video like that. I didn't really go down to plan because I can't really find a tree to goodness. So I thought, why don't you use this nice old lane back alley sort of thing and uh, just go crazy so right let's now get into the video and into the episode and i'll see you guys at the end of it so see you in guys <laughs> how much is how much is your phone how much is this one uh, this one just a pound oh. Thank you. Oh man, I would definitely have grabbed this. As you can see, it's a nice vintage Pokemon like poster with the stickers on them. But as you see, it's sadly dripping wet, so I had to leave it behind. But what a shame. That would have been great to have, but oh well. <laughs> As you see here guys, I'm at the 20p store and I've picked up a few things already which I'm definitely going to be getting, especially this game as well, which is actually complete, which is great. But yeah, as you see, I've had to put music on this because these guys always like to play music, which is it's great. I love listening to their music. They have some good tunes on every now and again. Um, but I can't have it on my videos because YouTube would give me a strike on it and uh, I don't really want that. I don't want uh, my videos to get a strike. So I have to put this music on, which I hope you guys don't mind. So I'm only going to be putting it on when there's music blaring away at people's stalls and I don't have any issues of uploading it to YouTube. But I hope you guys enjoyed the little bit of music I put in. I thought it's quite nice anyway, so hopefully it's alright.
I do love coming to this one guys, this stall, 20p guys, they're really good, uh, always got awesome bits and bobs, sometimes I don't, but found some cool bits here, a couple games, Jack, I got um, also got a little Shrek handheld thing, and a lightsaber, and even a fin, which is awesome, a nice fin from uh, Adventure Time, so yeah, 20p, you really can't go wrong for that, so I was happy with those.
How much is all this? One minute, Doc. Yeah. We've got cheese, mate. Yeah, I'm. I'm Five. Yeah, I'll do that, yeah. Really cool guys, picked up some vintage 90s uh, toys here, as you see some Mighty Max stuff, uh, a Batman and a weird head, I remember seeing it back in the day, it's missing quite a few pieces but I grabbed it. How much are CDs? 50p each. Yeah. If you want to buy in bulk, I'll no, just these. Do you a deal. Do these two. Thank you. Help me, please! <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah, I see oh, it. Yeah, yeah. 20p. I've got, um, got two. two yeah. Yeah, mate. Whoa. He had a, did you see the Phillips thing he had as well? Like some weird Phillips. I've only seen, I saw the Master System, that's what I've seen. He had um, like an old Phillips thing. Let me go and see, because he might right. have on the back of the van. Alright, cool. Yeah, you know. Charlie. Keep it on, Mama. Are you alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm just going to show you. Yeah, I saw the mass system there. Oh, right, yeah. Is it proper old stuff, isn't it? Yeah, the Amiga and that, isn't it? Yeah. Stuff like that. So for that, isn't it? Pete, did you have the Phillips? Yeah, I seen some Phillips stuff. Did that go? That's gone, yeah. Oh, that's it. Yeah, okay then. Alright, cheers. I'm not ready, I'm just going to get you ready. How much, you, how much is your Amiga? There's all them games fit in there, mate. There's only one loads of it. That thing there, yeah, yeah, I see, yeah. Uh, what, what, what are you asking on it? What did you do on, on the box one? I don't know. I've had a bid on it. Give me a bid on it and I'll tell you if it's... I don't know, man. I'm not very good at offers. <laughs> Sorry. Someone's bidding me. What's in there down there? bidding me on the old lot. Beat his bid. You can have it. All right. Cheers, thanks. That was really nice. That guy let me know where that Amiga stuff was for sale. Uh, yeah, I could have gave him an offer, but he wanted like a bid offer, which was, yeah, I didn't really want to give him an offer. And I don't really want it that much because I don't really collect Amiga. And most of the time, the Amigas leak over time and they can ruin the boards. But yeah, I left it. Now let's go to the pickups and see what we've got here, guys. Let's get the pickups done. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Warning. This may be the most weirdest and hyperactive pickup video you'll ever see on this channel. Hopefully you enjoy it anyway. Thank you very much for watching. Hi guys, welcome to the pickups. Oh, sorry, I just had a burger. It was pretty tasty. Um, so today wasn't the best. Pretty shim. So um, all I got today was pretty much some toys. So it's been a bit of a toy hunting day today. Um, came across this uh, clearance person. And wow, some retro bits. Um, yeah, one sec. So let me show you what I found. I found this thing, which I don't know why it does like a little cloudy for you. Uh, oh, so pardon me, so sorry. Oh, 
Right. So sorry about that. That was a really good pouch. But here we go. I've got this. It's like a uh, Batman thing. Let me find all the pieces it needs. So I've got the wing. I think it goes in somehow like that. Um, I've got the other retro toys. No idea where the other wing is though. But where is the other wing? Here we go. Other wings here. I think this is a Batman for him. It seems like a, a legit Batman. Um, this is a 19... 1990, no, 1989. Jesus, my eye. That is mental. Um, I knew this was vintage when I saw it. I remember seeing this sort of stuff as a kid. Um, I don't know if it's meant to have a bit at the back. And I know it's probably meant to have a bit of glass thing here. And I'm hoping this is the dude that goes in it. It looks like it's not. It says 1993 though. So probably not. Looks like it must fly like that. And then you have things, it looks like it has things to fire as well. Which I didn't see them in there. And it has like a weird clawy thing. But yeah, Batman. I paid £5 for this lot, which I'm about to show you. Little Batman guy. Woo, Batman! Batman! <laughs> yeah, I don't know what the fuck I'm on, but I'm on something. But yeah, that's him. He's not the right Batman for it, but he'll do for the Batman. Um, Leave that on there. Right, I remember this as a kid. I'm pretty sure I remember this. It's like pretty gooey, booey. Um, yeah, I don't know if I got all the parts. As you see, it's proper grimy. I don't know what year it is on it. I don't see it. I can't, I can't farm at the moment. It's basically some weird dude that you just like suck a monkey, monkey dung. Yeah, it's like a freaky guy. And you put slime in him. I'm pretty sure his slime pops out his head. And goes gooey and gooey wooey. Um, the part is there's all sorts of bits. I think I may have left some extra bits in there, but um, I may go back in actually because I recognise he had some normal teeth in there. Maybe that's what it's for. I don't know, but I got this an old, pretty much 90s, 80s. I'm pretty sure this is 90s. I remember I seen this advertised back in the, back in the day. 93 so yeah that is when it was out also found some pogs to go with it some slammers proper dirty as hell though and i just dropped another one and i just dropped some other bits on here but i'm not gonna go and dig out right now i found this which i think i know it looks like the same color as it so i don't know what it goes for he meant to screw them in his head or something there's loads of bits missing um but I paid £5 for this, which I'm showing you. This was the best find I found. I think there's a few bits missing on this. And it is this massive Mighty Max, like, I don't know, mountain thing. I've never seen one this big before. I remember see I've seen him about. But let's see if I can open this guy and give him a good old C and P, you know what I mean? Oh, shoot. Um, very, very dusty. But I've got some figures, some things in here for it, like a dragon in there. This little dude, I remember, I know, that, I know that's for it. I've got this uh, big thing here, which there should be another little piece, I remember. I did chuck a few things in there, which I thought could be for it. Um, but I have no idea where that goes. No. Does that go here? Looks like that does go there. Maybe. Yeah goes there I think um, so can we close it close the bridge so I got this guy um, for five pound with all the lots other stuff I got I'm pretty sure he could be quite a price one he's a bit cleaning and that but he is from 1992 Jesus so you see it's my match there's there on that um needs a good clean but yeah i think it's it's nice it needs a yeah a good wash really I, I may keep this does that go up there we go look that's pretty cool um very cool actually i really like it um i'm not sure what it's worth but it seems to be all complete with a little tower thing here which is the main bit you need like give it a good old tower wower you've got steps that go up here you can go up 
So yeah, pretty pretty nifty. So I'm really pleased to get in that. Also got, I always find these. Also got a uh, an old real Ghostbusters. Um, and now we're going to show you the 20p guy. It's pretty much all on clearance, guys. Uh, people. So I got um, Jack free which is complete from a 20p person luckily it's not water damage like a lot of this stuff is all all dripping wet it is just it's so bad like don't know where to leave this stuff they must leave it outside or something um i got this i got a fin he is soaking wet right now he is just dripping let me squeeze it oh you probably saw that drip then now it's in my car i see it on my steering wheel some aids on my steering wheel that's not nice um sorry about that but that's what it feels like um it's got a bit of rust in here but for 20p i'll have a feeling to let them dry out in the sun um next actually from that same tool toy person i thought i got this as well a really nice figure from um, lion king um it's like a really hard plastic one i'm not sure what it's for but it looks vintage gonna go right on my shelf also I've got this for 20p it's probably knackered I don't even know what it's worth but I thought for 20p you can't really complain if it's corroded inside let's have a look it seems all right it's drier than it's nasty boom right so yeah I don't know what the hell it does it could be fit for the bed I might just fr frisbee it down the lane and then burger nip it on the floor. Uh, I don't know if that worked, but it could live it the dream. Sorry, I'm being a bit weird. I'm being odd, because that's what I do. I found this thing as well. I have no idea what this is. It looks like something wrong, you know what I mean? Like a like a dong, look at it. Um, is it Toy Story? No. I know what that is, actually. And I've got the thing to go with it. I think I know what it is. I saw it in the thing. So yes, I know what it is. It's a it's a dragon you put on top of it and it and it balances. And I've actually got him at home from my childhood. So that's actually cool. So I can actually add him on it. Sweets. Um now I'm gonna show you some CDs. Oh actually I've got this. This is a game related item. 20p game related item. It looks shocking. Uh toys toy, sorry. Uh the best game out in the world. Shrek 2 um, from 1994. Jesus. This is probably worse than playing, I don't know, something crap. It looks terrible. But for 20p, I'd rather, I'll, I'll take it and see what it's like. And if it's rubbish, I'll just smash it in pieces. Got some CDs and I got a lightsaber which was 20p 20p for a lightsaber i don't know if it works if it's even worth anything it's from 2006 uh, i'll show you that first actually lightsaber it pops out hopefully it doesn't poke my eye out oh it just smacked my door my window though there we go lightsaber it's wet as it's wet it's as wet as the sky falls um yeah soaking wet probably knackered but for 20p it's worth a punt um got these these are soaking like a soaking thing is um slipknot classic awesome album raise against machines beastie album ah oh. what a pillock Empty. I didn't even look at this one, did I? I thought I'd be in there, it'd be alright. No. What a waste of money, but 20p, it's worth it for the case. Case is not cracked, so I'll just not smash that beast up. Um, is this in there? Yo, is it in there? Is that the right one? Yes. We have awesome album. You know, got a little um love it, ugh, got a love a little bit of Lincoln Park. This is their first album and it rocks the biscuit a child away. Um, condition is nice. I'm probably gonna put it on the way home actually. It is a great album. One of my first out, the first album I ever heard of them. They were tasty. 
Next we have a Walkman Pound. Comes with a free CD of uh, whatever that is. Some bollocks. And uh, it's, it's nice and clean. So that could should work. If not then what the hell is going on? Um, let's have a look what's in my bag. I went and got some other crap. And then that is my finds for the day. Uh, oh man, that's fucking grimy. Grim scene. It's a bit sticky in there. What was that? It was grimy and sticky. I don't know what it is. Either. What have I even done with the stuff I found? It's like I burnt my own balls. Maybe it's in that bit. I know I've got some other games, but I can't find them. I can feel them, but I can't. Last games I got. Oh, there's some bits in it, bits in here. What has fell out of the um, of that thing I bought? There's a weird um, crab thing, which I think's for it, and uh, this dude's definitely for it. So they can go inside that to make it complete. Um. I got time splitters, which is not bad. It's not too wet. I could hopefully save it when I get home. Um, I got Royal Rumble 2, which was 20p. You see, you're both 20p. I don't know if I take a quick back to them, but 20p, I'll have a wee. Um, I'm not sure what else I've got. Did I get any of, is there any other bits for that toy? I don't know. I think that is it. So that's my finds today, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smash that thumb and let me know that you liked it. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. You all mean the bacon rolls to me. Um, you mean loads. It's so great seeing so many of you guys coming to this channel, thumbing up the videos, subscribing, and even meeting me out and about, finding me, hunting, car booting, and you come up to me. It's great. I actually had a guy come up to me today who was Lee, so thanks a lot for coming up to me and uh, saying hi. And uh, yeah, nice to meet you. Hope you got some good stuff and all that jazz. And uh, yeah. Another roll to the sandwich. And let's just do this for the win. Oh, oh my God, I pressed the one button. So that's it, guys. See you in a bit. Different weekend at the car boot, guys. Let's do this. Let's find some beastie stuff. How much are your pops? Um, five each. Okay. Trying to think what he says to All right, Thank you. You alright? Yes, I'm going to go.
you say it for uh, seven on the so it's new one. How much is this one, darling? Three quid. Is that in that game? Uh, well, you've got a game there. Yeah, a lot of the mugs, a lot of the merch. Copy. Oh. Down, have you all bought it? Then? <laughs> so I put one down. Sorry, you feel got it, you've got it. <laughs> oh, that's, that's for that one, I've got one on there. Yeah. <laughs> Everywhere, aren't they? The discs. Next, yeah, I've got. That's what to it then. Rayman 3. I've got. I'll put one disc in. That's alright. <laughs> How much for these bits? Excuse me. A pound. That two, four, five, six, seven, nine altogether. Nine. Do you eight with um yeah, all that, yeah. Really happy with the stuff I found from this store here, guys. Eight quid. I've got a load of con a couple of controllers, some disc onlys, and some random Mega Drive and stuff like that uh, manuals, which is pretty cool. Um, so really happy with getting those. And also, see here is a, a Black Ops um, game. I must have it must have been scratched or something really bad for, for. I don't know why I left it, but it may not may have been too expensive. I can't remember. But yeah, I was happy what I got. That lady had some uh, nice bits before the store before had. Um, yeah. I, the PS4 controller, I have kind of fixed it. It just needs um, a new trigger button. I've cleaned it all up. It looks really nice, but it just needs a new trigger button. How much are, how much are your games? All these are pound each, but right. the PlayStation 3 ones, yeah. um, some's two, some's three. Right. Because they're a bit, every, all the other ones are pound. And if you have a few, well. Okay. They're all sold. What? All sold. Are they? Yeah. Right. Man's just coming to collect. There, are you? Oh, you're lucky there then.
Yeah, I've got, I've got one. Well, the only one... <coughs> and that's how you have controllers? Uh, 10 inch, yeah. 10 inch, okay. The PS3 ones? Yeah, 10 inch. Okay. What about the Xbox One? Uh, Lucy, Xbox, is that 15 or 20? Okay. Thank you. I thought I'd grab that game because I didn't have this uh, Jack game, so I thought, yes, I grabbed that. I think I've not got it. So if I only a, a quid or whatever, I was happy. Can't go wrong. Seen a few of these at the car boots. I've still got my original one of those little robot guys. I had one as a kid. Pretty cool little things. Yeah, they are a four. I saw the same price like before. I'll do six on that or seven. Uh, the cupcakes are in the metal one the side there. The only plastic is not in the This one. Yeah. I've got a big bag. Yeah. Yeah. These are well good, these were back in the day. How much is a yo yo? 50 pence. Yeah. Thank you. Sure, Thank you very much. Yeah, 50 p not too bad, is it? Roasting, though. I know, though. Anything what was popular was even. Let's see if it's still. Can you hold on? Wherever you are, mate. See if it yo yo guys still going. No. Yeah, it works. The yo yo. I want to sit it on the ground because that will probably shut over its old. Love a good 90s yo yo, guys. I had to get that for 50p. Gone straight to my yo yo collection. Retro, retro as, as as retro can be from the nineties. These were so cool. Like ones with little clutches in them. These are thunder ones. Awesome. That's now go to the pickups. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And so yeah, right, I need a pickup around. video on the way home now. So thought I'd do it like this. Um, what I got? Got this. Is the last thing I got. A uh, thunder. Is it thunder? Thunderstone. Um, old yo-yo from the nineties. Um, yeah, I remember these back in the kid. 50p, fully working, as you would have seen. 
so it's really good. Um, I've got this um, for 50p. I don't know if I've got it on video, I might have done. And the guys saying they're pretty fun, which they are, so I like it. I like them things when you have someone else to throw it with. It's a bit annoying when you throw it on your own because you end up running off for it. I've got some old game bits, but most it's all loose. But uh, I'll show you this anyway. So I got this with not the game in it. It's a Saturn case only. But I got these two games or three games. But a disc only of Dragon Quest. Um, disc only of um, Minecraft. And another disc only of it as well. Um, so maybe if I ever find a case or anyone has one, they might want a copy. So I got them that case. Um, got these. I've got this manual which I've got the game but I haven't got the box for it, so I thought I'd get that. And I got this manual for starting game. So at the moment it was um see if I can get this in there so Yeah, that was. I paid eight quid for this. Might have quite a bit of money. I got a really disgusting PS1 controller. Needs a good clean. It's horrible. Um, hopefully you can see it. Grimy as hell. And I got a disgusting PS4 controller. Hopefully it may work. It needs new rubbers on top. And sadly you see the coat here at the back is uh, rubbed away. But how do people get their stuff like that? It's proper destroy a dent there. But I paid eight quid so I don't know. Worth a gamble probably. Stick the buttons seem fine. Maybe that one's not that good. Sticky, maybe it just needs a bit of a clean. I don't know. If I paid eight quid, probably not very good, but I'll have to find that manual. Escape, which you didn't see me get on video, and that was two pounds. And I also got, is it Ter Terraria? Um, which I've actually got the cases at home. You would have probably seen it in one of my episodes, which I just literally pulled out. Would have been today, which is what date is it today? First of May. So that I've got an episode coming out today, which you see me pick up a game. Or oh, was it the episode today? Or was it? But no, it might have been the episode before. So it's only pick up one. But yeah, I've got that. And I've got a case for it anyway, so that's good. It needs a bit of a clean, but. I think I can fix that. It was 50p as well. Didn't get that on video. And I got Jack 2. It's in, uh, yeah, I don't think I got this version. So, uh, I don't know. Looks different to the one I have already. So, yeah, I got that. That was a quid. And that was it. And I got a load of potatoes, which I'm not going to show. Yeah. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's it. I think I didn't get a lot. It wasn't anything too awesome now, but some cool stuff. The Yogo is probably my favourite find of the day. So awesome. Well, see you later. Now let's head off now to do another another weekend at the car boot. Let's do it. Um, most of my most cars temp each. Oh, There's a couple of holes there. Right. I've got quite each one. Oh, uh, have a look. Yeah, no problem. And that might be trainers and edges. That's right. a mix. It's played as a deck. Right. And then this actual cards in there.
Thank you. How much one of them to? Uh, 150 for the pair of them. 150, so yeah, for the pair. Uh, Go on, I'll do that. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. The old problem I'll ask you now, isn't it? Yeah, the old classic one, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Putting my fold on it. Cheers, um, buddy. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you very much. I thought 150 for them two cards weren't that bad at all. They were in nice condition and I definitely didn't have um, one of them, I don't think. I can't remember which one it was. Um, but yeah, I got them. Garados, pretty awesome. And uh, the other one, which is, yeah, sick to the beans. You can't go wrong with retro Pokemon cards. And for 150, in that condition, you really can't really say no to those. So straight into my pocket. And let's head off now to see what else we can find. So let's do it. How much are these? Two pounds. Two pounds. Got the batteries in it. Mm. Does it? Okay. All right. <laughs> this one working as well. Yes. This one's tail. Well, five pound each. Yeah. Right. right. <laughs> Would you do three pounds for the two? Because that one's got a broken toe, isn't it? Yeah, right. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Thank you. Oh, sure. You turn it on. Yeah, I got, I got some, I got some Pokemon cards. A couple. Uh, black, black Persia. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll mention. Did you get any? No, I got them here last week. You had some good, you had, you had some good price. One pound fifty, fifty. I paid for two cards. Yeah, I, you had them last week. I went through them. I thought, I don't know. Yeah, I'm they're not, not worth a lot, but no, no. I, I, I shut up. This one night from two thousand, I would have been ten years old when this came out. Oh, uh, what's this one? Yeah. Oh yeah, that one's supposed to have a bonus in. Yeah, I paid three quid for the two. Furbies, they come out in 98. Yeah, and they come out after, just before 2000. Yeah. That hurts. Shut up. Shut up. I turned it on and now I can't turn it off. The needs is probably... It senses off him. Yeah, I know it has a boner, yeah. yeah. This one's missing its tail, and now it's broken, it's more. <laughs> 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 I don't want it to do the roly poly, did it? <laughs> I 
I'll have a look at the floor. I'll have a look at the floor. I don't know. Probably, or you can make me enough You say a pound each, you say? Yeah, yeah I do. Thank you. One, two, three, four. Should have bought more. That's it then. I've <laughs> actually still got a PlayStation 2, you know, with six log games. Yeah. Oh, I don't, yeah. yeah. Pop your old classic. I've got five of them now. Thank yeah. you, darling. That's wonderful. Thank you very much. Chuffed to finding them guys. I've, I saw them on the on the lady's seat, and I said, "Oh, can I have a look at your games?" And she uh, busted out some games, and look at that, some great titles there for a quid each. Can't go wrong. Yeah, brilliant. Pound each. Bonus. Trade, trade. Pretty much trade in, trade. Them two on two short. Yeah. Them three. At least fifteen quid. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, she had them in a in a. What the hell's that? Mini Furby. Mini Furby. You collect them as well, then? Yeah. Well, we've got I, three go, big I, ones. I don't get the new ones. I don't really like them, if I'm honest. I like the old ones, though. It's a bit weird. I don't keep moving around, like, doing that weird, like, bendy thing or whatever. We saw them without batteries. I make too much noise. There's a few of that ones there. There's some other guy. i got some other ones as well. Yeah, got, got, got. Destiny, I think. <coughs> I think got that one. <laughs> that one. I've got all of them, I think. So I think oh, it's not. Yeah. This, what came out? Oh, is that in there? Is it in yeah, there? Could be. That's third, yeah. Huh? Two copies of the same game. Uh, I had this thing dilemma yeah. last night when I was trying to match it up. I couldn't work out which one should have one and which one should have two discs. Maybe, so. Yeah, it could be. Yeah. Is that when it's Yeah, is it combo two discs? Yeah, probably, yeah. Not too bothered, there's another one. Yeah. Just one. Crack down, that's alright. Yeah, that's yeah. If you come every week, I've been some more next week. Oh, yeah. The, um, yeah, we always come, yeah, yeah. looking for games. You know the Lego ones? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, I think, yeah. you know, Batman Lego. Um, Pen, I think, I'm not too sure if we've got them all, but yeah. all yeah, the yeah, pens. Man. Harry Potter Lego, I think there is. Yeah, Thank awesome. you, darling. Yeah, I'll tell you, if, if you're down here next week, yeah. we'll come straight to you. I will be, if, if you we'll carry nice. on like this yeah. and keep making some money, I'll be here next week, don't worry. And it's not pouring in the rain. No, if you yeah. get any older systems, I'll yeah. them down as well. PlayStation, PlayStation 2 with over 60 games. Yeah, bring them down, we'll probably have, yeah, we'll have, we'll have, have to sit next to it, telly, but you know, everything, all your classics, yeah. um, Tekken, we'll Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, the system will probably go straight away, but as I say, the games, that's all we have to do. Yeah, yeah, we've got all the customs already, haven't we? Yeah. Boxed and put away for years and years and years. Yeah, that's all we've got. PSPs we've got. Oh, bring them down. Yeah. Anything, anything you find, bring it down and we'll grab it yeah, off you. Yeah, right. Thank you. Cheers, thank you. Well, you spotted. That's all matters the game, the system. I've got loads of them. Loads of the games? Yeah, just after the games, man. Oh, cool. um, I don't know, like. Should have seen your bag like that I oh, know, yeah. It's it's <laughs> no, it's, it's a random toy, it won't go off. Seven quid? You I need to find a screwdriver or something, I need to get the batteries out of it. It's driving me mad. There's no off switch, mate. Uh, I don't know to do To be fine, sure. Yeah. 
got a manual now, I've got the manual for yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, thingy small, I thought, yeah. Oh, probably in the system. Probably is. It's probably in the system, isn't it? Yeah, probably. Turn on. It's going to explode. <laughs> the guy thinks it's a bomb. <laughs> It does sound like one. That's to find a store selling tools, that's going to borrow a screwdriver. Yeah, I saw a guy over there somewhere. Do you want to... The thing is driving me mad. Oh, I just clocked the top of the um, weed resort box. Oh, right, yeah. Yeah, and I thought, I'll look in there and I'll just notice all the games in there, I thought, that's it. I mean... Can I borrow your screwdriver quickly? Because yes, this yes. thing is driving me mental. <laughs> Thank you. Can you do it? Turn the back here. Yeah, you can't turn it off. That's <laughs> something you give somebody you don't like, then, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look, I've got you a present. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, mate. At least you know it yeah, that's the main thing. A lot of things don't, you know, they're not working. But at least oh, I know. Mate. Thank you very much. Oh my god, finally. This goddamn toy was a nightmare. Bloody hell, guys. So sorry, but this toy was, in, was insanely annoying around the car boot. But luckily, I found someone who had a screwdriver and let me uh, use it, which is awesome. <laughs> Already? Yeah, I, know. That's cute. I know. I need it. Though. I need it after the way I played yesterday. How much is scooter? That one's 20, that one's 10. Man. Okay, no worries. It was 300 pounds. Yeah, I remember them being, yeah. yeah. I remember them. They're quite good. Cheers. Wait, 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 have a listen. Can you hear anything? Quiet. I took the batteries out. <laughs> so about, no, I asked the guy over there, he's like, this thing is driving nuts, can I borrow your screwdriver? Yeah, sure. He's like laughing. <laughs> oh, man. Sure. Peace. <laughs> yes, I whipped out a battery. Nice one for giving me that, man. Awesome. That's all right. I don't know, I got it. That's just probably just, anything that only came through, like a console yeah, or something. Yeah, it came through with the game, I think. Yeah. Maybe. I was just walking by and I thought, I'll just ask him to see how Get it nice and wet. I thought I was going to smoke things, just take it off at once. <laughs> These aggressors, it is wet, but it's not as wet as it has been. Let's now rock it to the next car boot of this weekend. Let's get down it! How much is this, guy? That one I'd take eight quid for it. The lowest I'd take is seven. Okay, no worries. Thank you. Right. Hey. You're probably all thinking, what the hell is he buying a beach ball for? Well, actually, I brought it for download. I was chucking it into the crowd when I went to see um, Def Leppard. I chucked it into the crowd there. If you have not seen my episode, it's in there.
How much are you gain? That was way over my price range of picking up a camera, so definitely leaving that behind. It wasn't even in the greatest link either, so didn't grab that. I left it for someone else to buy. She wanted this, but then she said no, cool, it's got a little steam. Is, is this a pound? Yeah. There you go, thank you. Thank you, Ronnie. A squirtle for the car. It has like a little thing where you can stick it on the window. It doesn't stick that well, but only for a pound I grabbed it anyway. I've got 10p, that's what I've got left. Oh, Is that alright? Yeah. Thank you very Good much. Up. Home Alone book. I thought, what the hell? Never seen that before. And sadly, I only had um, 10p left, but luckily the guy took it. Um, I felt a bit bad giving him 10p, but I literally had nothing else except for notes. And I felt bad asking him to change a note. So he took 20 or 10p, sorry, when he only wanted 20p for it. But anyway, let's now head off to the pickups, guys. Let's get down and look at what I got today at this car boot. Yo! Hi guys, welcome to the pickup. So today, as you see, I'd hit up three car boots. The third, no, the second car boot, I didn't get any footage of it. So, I'm going to show you what I got at the two car boots that I did get footage of. Um, the first car boot wasn't the greatest, but it was quite slow. But I got some games in the end. You might have saw that, I think you did. Um, 
the lady literally was setting up and I saw on a passenger side seat, passenger seat, that she had a box of uh, Xbox 360 games. So I said, oh, can I have a look at your games, please? And she whipped them out. And uh, yeah, she was surprised that they're sold so quickly. So she's got a lot more stuff. So maybe next week could be pretty awesome. She says if she sells really well today, like, like we brought the ones we did off her, she said she'll uh, definitely bring some more next week. So fingers crossed she should be there again. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll be free to go again. I don't know, but hopefully. So let's show you what I've got today. Um, as I said, it wasn't the best. Wasn't um, crazy awesome, but the stuff I got, I'm happy with. So I'll show you the games I got. I think I got five games off her, which I thought were weren't too bad. If I can find them all. Another one there, another one here. So the games I got are these ones. So I got Transformers, Xbox 360. Um, I'm not sure. I know that uh, Xbox um, One one was quite good for trading in, so I'm not sure how much this one I get for this one. Um, I've got my other one Mega now. It's on its way from CEX, so um, I'll still be still chasing bits into CEX to get a couple of games that I'm after. Um, some of the more valuable high high end top end ones. So yeah, a way of doing it is CEX. I think everyone, a lot of people do it now, and I see why. You can buy a game for a quid each, trade it in for eight pound credit. That's like you know, it's really good. So I've got this one. I'm not sure the value of it. This one was four pound credit, but I think it's gone down to three pound now, which is annoying. But it has all the discs in there, which is nice. I've never seen that version as well. With the, actually with the piece in the middle, usually you have to put it on top of the other one. So that's quite cool. I got. Um, Transformers Dark um, Dark of the Moon so that one as well Harry Potter he's just got loads of Harry, like Lego games Harry Potter Lego um, and Lego Movie so not bad for a quid each so please are getting them finally got some games today um, got a Lego guidebook for a quid I didn't get some video, this is from this car boot, the second one I did, or the third one I did, quid, probably not worth it, but I thought I might as well grab it. I got from this car boot as well, I grabbed myself um, some Total Beaches, these are in very nice shape, uh, most of the time I see them they're really battered, um, and I've been after a pair, because my, I've been using not gaming ones i've been using some music ones for gaming and this will be so much better people can be able to hear me better than mics and for four quid i thought that was a really good price um yeah really nice nick like like, like brand new and he said he only got any removed them on because he wanted different color ones so yeah i really like them fucking hell some motorbike going by there and hear that he was going slower than he was definitely going faster than another one. They're definitely going faster than uh, 50, 40 miles an hour. It's a 40 mile an hour road. And they're going at least, I don't know, 60 maybe. Sounds like it. But yeah, that is um, really cool. I'm really pleased with that. Whack them on. And I'm feeling like a game set. I'm going to try them out actually. Let me quickly try them. They sound pretty good. Noise cancellation y. I think my phone's fucked, like the headphone jack. I'm gonna have to get a new phone. That's pretty sure. I keep trying to play music on it, and the headphone jack just doesn't work. Yeah, my headphone, my phone's fucked. I need to get a new one. It's bullshit. But yeah, it's due an upgrade. But I think I broke the headphone jack. It's pretty sure it's knackered. It's two years old. Don't blame it being fucking dying off. I've used it like death, like hell. Getting a bit too hot now. So, yeah, four pound for those. Pretty happy with that. Really done it. Uh, what else did I get? You got this, which you would have seen me on the set on the first car, but it was driving me insane. 
as you've seen, I finally got um, a charger to actually a charger. I finally got a um, screwdriver to take the back off, to turn this bloody thing off. It's meant to have like a little mouse with it as well, but um, it's missing. But I got this and the other one for three pound each. They're old from like the nineties. A bit like a Furby kind of thing, but robots. I was pleased to get in him. And I also got the dog one as well, which is somewhere in here, which I think is in the other part. The other part. Which is here. Um, this one is missing its tail though. But he needs a bone as well to make himself make him work. I'm not sure how you set him off though. There we go. He's a little bony. But you remember those back in the day? Also a beach ball. This is for downloads or thrown into the crowd. 50p. I got myself a tech deck, which I don't know if I got on video, I might have done. Um, tech decks are quite, you know, collectible I think nowadays. I'm not sure what year this one is, but it's a cool little hand. It's actually a hand deck, so you do it with your hands instead of your fingers. It's pretty cool. And then I got myself this, um, which is a Yu-Gi-Oh! like folder thing I think they've made this folder themselves but um, they're not in there rightly they've just been shoved in there so I don't know what's here I don't know anything about you yeah, really but I paid £1.50 I thought that's a fair price just to have a little woman you know these usually sell quite well at um, conventions and there's a few shinies in here but yeah these usually sell quite well at conventions I've been doing like where I can take some of their people kids love them same as the Pokemon cards, I love it in them. But there's loads of bits and bobs, so. It also has a few of the old Pokemon ones as well, like. So. A lot of them just fell out of there. They're not really in there properly. But there's a couple shinies, like this guy, this one. I know it's not anything special. I can get it out. It looks fake, but shiny there. That's a shiny. Better than nothing. So I got those. I'm not going to sit here looking at them for ages because I don't really know much about Yu Gi Oh! It's not my cup of tea. I remember I did start collecting them a bit back at school, but I wasn't really into them. Not like I was with Pokemon cards. There's a few of these cards in here. Pokemon ones, which are here. So there's all, loads of them in there, you would have seen. But yeah. Is it a proper binder? Someone made this binder. I don't know, but got that, and I got a Walkman as well, or like a CD Walkman. And then last but not least, um, patch you would have seen me with. I don't know if you would have got my video. We don't got. I didn't get my video of him giving me this, but he uh, gave me this, which was the woman gave it to him for free because she didn't know what it was. It is um, a, a DVD sort of soundtrack, I don't know what it is, for um, number two. I've not got it, so yeah, so you think it came free with the game or something like that. So that's pretty cool. And that's it guys, that's it for my uh, find. Oh yeah, I got this as well to put in my car. It's a very messed up the squirrel, but he would do just to sit with my, on the other side. So I've got a squirtle. There was a Charmander there, but he looked really weird. So I didn't like him. But I'm hoping he'll stick on there nicely. Keep the car beastie. I don't know how he's going to sit, but he swings around like that. And I've got um, Ditto on the other side. So that's it, guys. That's my finds today. Thank you for coming along with me. 
Um, and uh, yeah, we'll hopefully. Oh yeah, last but not least, sorry, so sorry. I got this and this. I got an ET for twenty p. I didn't get it in my video, but I got this in video. I didn't even know they did a um, Home Alone book. It's just a book, and it's got uh, some pictures of the film in it and all that. So basically, is it a book version? Let's have a look what it says at the start. But yeah, I got this, as you've seen, really cool, 10p I ended up paying for this book, because uh, I only had 10p left, I literally, that's all my change gone today, spent all my change, and uh, yeah, that's it guys, um, and I got an ETH as we've seen, and um, that's it, that's my finds, hope you guys enjoyed the finds, thanks for coming along as I've always mentioned in this video, and I'll see you in the next one, thanks guys. Welcome back, hope you guys enjoyed the video, as you see, yeah, I'm still here, and um, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed what I got, that um, annoying um, tiger, like electric, um, what was it, robot cat, was a nightmare in this episode, it wouldn't go, it wouldn't turn off, I didn't know how to do it, so I had to find a battery, well not a battery, a, a screwdriver to get the battery down, and yeah, I did it, but that's what I ended up doing, and it worked. So all the stuff I got was I was really pleased with. And I'm going to end it here and say thank you guys so much. If you like me being weird like this and doing them out in the countryside, a nice pickup or an intro, whatever you want me to do, I could do it and just be weird as hell. Because it's just me all over. I've been wanting to do something that's just something a bit different. And sort of like got the idea for OC Ultra because he does his videos out in the countryside or wherever he wants to. So I thought I'd just join him on the fucking randomness that he does. So here we go. My uh, version of his kind of type, type of new video. Here we go. Hope you guys enjoy it as well. Also subscribe to OC Ultra. He's a legend. He's, he's a really good legend. You want to check out his videos. Fantastic. And yeah, massive shout out to him for giving me some ideas to do something like this. That's it. Thanks very much and I'll see you guys next one. Bye.